Hello my friends, this is Lionel Anderson here with you guys with a brand new YouTube video. In today's video, we're going to be exposing Elon Musk and the real reason he bought Twitter. The dark NWO agenda behind all of this. Do not be deceived by him, my friends. A lot of people in the truth movement are being deceived by him. He's classic controlled opposition and he's a huge puppet of the NWO and we're going to be exposing all of that today. All right, my friends, so before we do, I'm just going to encourage everybody to subscribe to my YouTube. As I say, subscribe to survive. I cover all from NWO, uh, occult knowledge, the knowledge that the NWO is hiding from us, uh, Illuminati, all that great stuff. I'm exposing it all, so subscribe. And be sure to check out my friends at KarmaRocks.net for beautiful Organite pyramids, okay? This blocks... 5G and EMF radiation is made with real copper, real magnetic powder. It's the real deal. Uh, so definitely check that out. They also got the best crystals around. It's the only place I trust with my crystals. So check it out. Christmas is right around the corner. It makes a great gift idea. The link is in the description. You will not be disappointed. All right, my friends, let's just get into it now, shall we? So yeah, a lot of people deceived thinking that Elon is some kind of savior. Oh, he's fighting for our free speech. He, he's going against the NWO. Well, I'm going to point out some of the obvious things that he's involved with, my friends. Uh, number one, he's got this whole agenda with these driverless cars, which is an NWO agenda with his Tesla and all that. Electric cars, okay? That's the NWO's biggest agenda. They want to switch everybody to electric cars, okay? He's beaming 5G satellites up in space, 5G, 6G, 7G, he's involved with it all, okay, which is an NWO agenda. The man runs Neuralink. He wants to put a chip inside your brain. Artificial intelligence, NWO agenda, okay? He's part of so many agendas with the least. You do not get to be the world's richest man if you're not involved with them, okay? It, it just doesn't happen. Okay, so he's obviously a part of them. And there's a big agenda being played out here with Twitter, my friends. Uh, first off, the elites own Twitter, okay? And they're not going to let him come in and buy it from them. No, they let him have it. This is all part of a controlled opposition uh, thing to get people from the right sucked in and to trust him and get sucked into the trap. Because he's not just buying Twitter so you could have freedom of speech and all that. That's the front to deceive you and to gain your trust, to trust him. Think he's one of the good guys. So you'll go along with the true agenda behind Twitter. Okay, so what's the true agenda with Twitter? Well, Elon has already admitted what he's going to be doing with Twitter. Okay, and here you go. He's going to be making, turning it into an app called X. The Everything app. And he announced that on his Twitter. Here's the tweet. Check it out. Okay, there you go. So he's he wants to accelerate this to turn it into X, the Everything app. So what is this X, the Everything app? Well, Elon has come out and said it's going to be similar to WeChat, which is China's biggest app okay this is china's biggest app that they're using right now uh and it does everything as well and mainly to do purchases and buy stuff this and that okay take a look at what he said about turning it into a we the wechat of the west take a look okay so what is wechat all about then my friends WeChat is connected to the social credit score system in China. That's right. WeChat has its own social credit score. Take a look at this. All right. There you go. So the way this social credit system works with WeChat is people will buy uh, they have to create an account and they have to use their real name. They have to verify their identity so they know it's you. And then they'll, based on their purchases, 
on what they're buying and whatnot, they'll get a social credit system. And based on their score, depending what they buy and if their payments went through and this and that, okay, depending on what they buy, then they'll get in-store things like credit, uh, coupons, discounts, uh, stuff like that, okay? But what it's doing is it's surveilling you because it's got your real identity. You need to submit your real identity. It's a surveillance app to surveil your every action. And also, they're tracking all your purchases, okay? They're tracking all your purchases. And then it gets related back to their main social credit score, I'm sure, okay? Social credit system. And Elon Musk thinks that this is great, and he wants to bring this to North America. So he bought Twitter, he bought it, and now he's admitted he's accelerating it into his own version of WeChat called X, the everything app. So it's gonna be the same. This is gonna be a, a way to get people to buy into the social credit system because we know that's the elite's big agenda and that they're gonna be bringing that in next, right? 100% they're going to be bringing that in. So before they bring in the main social credit score that's going to dictate everything, they want to bring in something soft just to see if the people will fall for it. So he, it's going to be Elon Musk marketing it as a very cool thing. Oh, sign up for it and you'll, you'll get uh, discounts and coupons and this and that. And, you know, everybody trusts Elon now. Oh, he's against the new world. He wouldn't lie to us. I trust him. So this social credit system is good. We're going to use this social because this is the good one. We trust Elon. He's for freedom of speech, right? That's what all these people are thinking with Elon. So it's a perfect way to get people to trust the social credit system. Have Mr. Freedom of Speech here. Oh, he wouldn't deceive you. Oh, we could trust his social credit system. It's all to get you warmed up to the social credit system. All meanwhile, it's surveilling your every move because you're gonna have to submit your real name and everything like that. And uh, it's gonna be tracking all your purchases, which is right in line with the digital ID, right? Uh, the digital ID and the CBDC that they want to bring in, the new digital currency uh, that's going to track your every move, right? It's going to track everything, every purchase. Well, it's going to be directly going through this X at everything app that's going to track all your purchase history. And not to mention just the name X. What does that mean, X, the, the everything app? It's all a big NWO, satanic occult ritual, my friends. And everything they choose for a name and everything like that, it's all involved with the agenda, my friends. So what does X mean? Okay, X has been used by the cult for thousands of years now. X is a huge occult uh it has a huge occult meaning. For example, Skull and Bones, they, uh, the NWO secret society, Skull and Bones uh, at Yale, right? They have the skull and the bones in an X, right? Take a look. That's right. Uh, even back to Egyptian times, Osiris, the, the god Osiris would hold his things in an X, okay? And uh, he's in Lil. He's the equivalent to the reptilian Anunnaki Enlil. Take a look. All right, it goes on and on how they've used X, but the biggest thing that concerns me, my friends, X means X marks the spot. X means marked. It's a mark, okay? X is a mark. What is related to the social credit system, digital ID, and all this stuff. The mark of the beast, okay? This is the beast system. And this is just another addition to the beast system, yeah? Mark of the beast, my friends. You're gonna have an app that's gonna track everything you do, all your purchases. It's gonna be connected 100% to the CBDC and all of that. It's part of the beast system. So you're going to have X, the everything app on your phone that's tracing everything you do. Guess what? You've been marked. X marks the spot. You've been marked. You've accepted the mark. 
If you want to trust Elon and believe, oh, he can't for freedom of speech. Don't be so naive. Wake up by now. And I mean that with love, okay? I don't mean to offend any of my followers who, or anybody who's watching this who supports Elon. This is a wake up call for you. Just because the guy goes out there and says what you want to hear and, uh, and, and says a few things that are against the establishment doesn't mean jack crap. It's called controlled opposition. It's to suck you guys in, to deceive you. Because if you had some person that nobody likes out there promoting it, like Mark Zuckerberg, well, everybody, nobody likes Mark Zuckerberg or any of these NWO twats, okay? Nobody likes them, and nobody's going to trust if they try to roll out a social credit system. They're going to know immediately. So they have Mr. Freedom of Speech, Mr. Elon, oh, he's fighting the NWO. Oh, yeah, he's coming to save us, right? Oh, we could trust him with his social credit score. <laughs> the man just dressed up for Halloween as the devil's champion. That's right. Take a look at this. There you go. And people say, it's Halloween. He's just dressing up for Halloween. He, he, people dress up as the devil for Halloween. He doesn't know. He, he doesn't mean it seriously. He's the world's richest man who's connected to the NWO. He knows exactly what he's doing. Baphomet, upside down cross, big NWO Illuminati symbols. He's mocking you. He's rubbing it in your face. All right? A lot of you are still saying that, that he's fighting the NWO. It's just not true, my friends. He is part of it. He's a big part of it. And he's deceiving y'all. And you gotta stop trusting in him. We need to wake up now, my friends. Not me, but you guys need to. Not everyone, but a lot the people who believe that he's on our side. The people who think Donald Trump is on our side. It's time to wake up, my friends. It's all controlled opposition. They're trying, they know that they're losing this fight. And they know we don't trust their leaders. So they're putting in leaders and they're putting in uh, people who appear to be on our side to say the things we want to hear. That's their new agenda, to trick us, okay? That's what's going on here. Because they know we don't trust the other people anymore. So they got to put people there to tell us what we want to hear so that we'll start believing in their system again. And of course, they're going to try and get us to accept this whole Neuralink agenda and all that, you know. Again, with the whole Mark of the Beast thing, well, the, the Bible says that the, the Mark of the Beast is going to be in the forehead or the right hand, right? Well, Elon wants to put a chip in your brain, which is pretty close to the forehead. So there you go. Another Mark of the Beast sign of Elon. Some people could say he's the Antichrist, right? Because uh, the Antichrist is said to come in and deceive people, right? He's supposed to come and bring peace and everybody's going to think he's good, right? And then he's going to deceive everybody. Betray you. Which X also means betrayal. So it's funny. A lot of these people who support Elon claim to be Christians, right? Because they're on the right. He's fooling a lot of people on the right who are, oh, we're Christians. But yeah, you guys not read the whole part of the Bible that talks about the Antichrist, the man of sin coming in, deceiving everybody, the great delusion, I think they call it. Like, oh, Elon's good. Yeah, we're Christians. Yeah. Oh, I'm sorry. You're being deceived. I'm sorry. That's it. So that's it, my friends. I want to hear what you guys have to say about all this. Leave a comment down below. And if you enjoyed my video, uh, check me out on Patreon. Exclusive content you won't get anywhere else. The link is in the description. Uh, occult class, health class, spiritual-based videos. The support means the world to me. Or if you don't want to do that, you could simply just buy me a coffee on the website. Buy me a coffee. Uh, I appreciate any help I could get because this is what I'm doing full time now. Link is in the description to all those things. Then remember karmarocks.net. And that's about it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Share this with your friends and family. 
Much love to all of you, yeah? Uh, I just don't, I hate seeing my people get deceived by controlled opposition. So, like I said, if you were on the fence about Elon or if you think he's a good guy, it's time to wake up. It's all part of the agenda. All right, my friends. Take it easy. Lionel, signing off.